Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars custom diecast review. Today we're going to take a look at Monty Lightning McQueen. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So, <clears throat> Monty McQueen, as Lightning McQueen was known back then, began his racing career as a student of the Fast Track Race Academy. He befriended a fellow student named Carl and the two formed a close bond. They later attended the final race of the semester to compete for five available slots for sponsorship. Unbeknown to Monty, Carl had a pity loosen his bolts, resulting in his tire coming loose in the middle of the race against Carl and was forced to withdraw. Carl later won a sponsorship and graduated afterwards, but Monty became weary of working with others and became a self-proclaimed one-man show. Monty continued his, he continued his studies, but he kept to himself and didn't make any friends at the academy. At the academy's monthly 25-lap sprint, Monty broke the school record, and his fellow racers nicknamed him Lightning due to the sheer speed he'd shown he was capable of. The nickname Lightning would be stuck with him for the rest of his life. Monty or Lightning graduated at the top of his class and was accepted into the school team. However, he wouldn't be given a sponsor yet. He won his first race by two laps and caught the eye of a talent scout named Harv who offered him a deodorant sponsor called Smell Swell. Now take note I made this Monty Lightning McQueen out of a dupe out of a out of the out of a the normal plain cars one lightning mcqueen without the rusty sticker as i've shown in one of my previous videos yes. or should i say two of my previous videos yes. but speaking of cars one lightning mcqueen i'm glad the only cars one lightning mcqueen i'm gonna be sticking to is this one with the Rusty's logo on the spoiler. And now without any further ado, let's dig right into the review. So here we've got his happy facial expression, his headlight stickers and his white shiny teeth, no sponsor logo on the hood, no number or name signature on the top. No tambos anywhere, just the black wall tires on the red rims and the exhaust pipes and the gas cap. No sponsor logo on the spoiler. The taillight stickers and no sponsor logo in the middle. No rookie stripes. And that is it. Now let's compare them to the Normal Cars 1 Lightning McQueen. Here are some similarities and differences. Both are Lightning McQueen. Both bear the color red. And both share the same body mold and a facial expression. But here are some similarities and differences. Number 95 on headlight sticker, no 95 on headlight sticker, Rusty's logo on hood, no Rusty's logo on hood, lightning bolt stickers, no lightning bolt stickers, 95 in name signature on top, no 95 or name signature on top, Rusty's logo on spoiler, no Rusty's logo on spoiler, 95 on yellow lightning bolt, 
no 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 nine, number 95 on yellow lightning bolt just the gas cap and the red rims on the black wall tires light years signature no light years signatures sponsor logos no sponsor logos Rusty's logo in the middle no Rusty's logo in the middle 95 on taillight sticker no 95 on taillight sticker yellow rookie stripe with the slogan medicated bump ointment no yellow rookie stripe with the slogan medicated bump ointment and now for the smell swell lightning McQueen Now, again, both are Lightning McQueen, both share the same body mold and expression, but here are some differences. I mean, and both have the blank tail light stickers. Both have no 95 or name signature on top and no sponsor logo on spoiler. Smell Swell logo on hood, no Smell Swell logo on hood, indicating that this McQueen won't be given a sponsor or yet. Both have the exhaust pipes and the gas caps and the red rims on the black wall tires. 95 with yellow lightning bolt, no 95 with yellow lightning bolt. Tail light, both have the taillight stickers, no sponsor logo in the middle, and no rookie stripes on back bumper. And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other Cars 1 Lightning McQueens. We've got normal Cars 1 Lightning McQueen, ton, light, ton Lightning McQueen, Finish line Lightning McQueen. Dirt Trek Lightning McQueen. Cactus Lightning McQueen. Smell Swell Lightning McQueen. Cruising Lightning McQueen. Radiator Springs Lightning McQueen. Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen. Motoropolis Lightning McQueen. And Dynaco Lightning McQueen. And that is it. Now take note I got the info of Lightning McQueen's Life in the Racing Academy me, from one of Ned Wheeler's Cars Explained videos. I'll, so I'll give you a link to it in the description or down below or in the pop-up suggestion or both. But what do you guys, other, but other than that, what do you guys think? Which Cars 1 Lightning McQueen diecast is your favorite? And which and how do you describe Carl, the student from Lightning, Lightning's Days, as Monty McQueen? Le let me know what you think, as well as leaving suggestions of which car to review next in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!